हेलो स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू स्टडी अबाउट क्लास सिक्स चैप्टर इलेवन मेजरमेंट एंड मोशन पार्ट वन टॉपिक्स टू बी कवर्ड हिस्ट्री ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट एंड मेजरमेंट हिस्ट्री ऑफ ट्रांसपोर्ट अर्ली ह्यूमन्स टू ट्रैवल बाय फूड एंड कैरी देयर गुड्स दम सेल्स आफ्टर अ वाइल दे स्टार्टेड यूजिंग एनिमल्स टू कैरी दैम and their goods from one place to another later the invention of wheel changed the way people travel carts drawn by oxen or horses were made to carry more people and goods people used hollow wooden logs to travel across river later they made boats to sail on water slowly the invention of railway and steam engine changed the way the people and goods were transported from one place to another measurement the process of determining the length size and amount of physical quantity using specific devices is called measurement for example thermometer is used to measure the temperature ruler is used to measure the length body parts used for measurement in ancient time people used different body parts such as hand span foot span cubit and pace for measurement hand span distance measured by a human hand from the tip of the thumb to the tip of the little finger when stressed is called hand span using a hand span for measuring short length is a common practice even today in your home you would have noticed your mother or grandmother measuring the length of a woolen sweater using her hand span while knitting foot span the length between the toe and the heel of a foot is called foot span cubit the length between the elbow and the tip of the middle finger of the open palm is called a cubit pace one natural step about 30 inches long is called a pace one way to measure ground distance is the pace count standard units of measurement in 1617 the french astronomer and mathematician gabriel montan created a standard sets of unit to measure called the metric system this system was standardized in republic of france in 1790 adopting standard units of measurement does not solve the problem all over the world people may using different sets of standard unit of measurement for the sake of uniformity scientists all over the world have accepted a common set of standard units of measurement called the international system of units or si units so what do you mean by si units is the is international system of unit is have accepted a common set of standard unit of measurement the si unit for length is meter si unit of mass is kilogram and si unit of time is second measuring the length of a curved line students can you measure the length of a curved line using a scale it is not possible to directly measure the length of a curved line using a scale don't worry a thread or a string can be used to measure the length of the curved line you can do this activity at your home also take a thread and a and place it on the curved line mark the points where the curved line begin and end on the thread 
stretch the thread along the length of a scale and measure the distance between the two marks on the thread thank you for watching